In this module, I will provide you a broad overview of next five modules to cover highway engineering. Highway engineering involves design, construction, operation, and maintenance of roads to ensure safe and effective transportation of people and goods. Following are the key industries if you choose highway engineering as a profession. Within consulting firms, you have highway engineering consulting firms, infrastructure financing, advisory firms, and asset management consulting firms. Within construction industry, you have road construction firm, vendors, and suppliers. Within government organization, you have development authorities, regulatory authorities, and RSA agencies. Within funding agencies, you have banks, and global investment funds. Within educational institutions, you have research, and development centers and technical institutions. Following are the key components of highway engineering. Highway design, where we will cover link design, junction design, departure, relaxation, and design checks. In pavement design, we will cover full depth pavement construction and overlay inlay treatment. We will also cover standard details, earthwork treatment, and highway quantities. We will discuss junction design of four-legged junction, three-legged junction, and two junctions. We will also cover grade separated junction, such as half clover leaf, dumbbell roundabout, two bridge roundabout, etc. We will cover junction modeling and also the swept path analysis as shown in the pictures. Then we will cover roundabout design. Here, we will cover geometric design, entry alignment design, crown line design, etc. Roundabout is one way circular intersection where the traffic flows around a central island. We will cover complete process of pavement design, from traffic loading to pavement design and foundation design, etc. We will also discuss existing pavement improvement process and subgrade improvement process. Full depth pavement construction covers from the surface course to geo grid, as shown here. In standard details, we will cover all highway details, such as pavement details, curbing and edging details, footpaths details, bus stop details, etc. As an example, TRIF curbs are normal containment curbs and generally used in urban roads where horizontal spacing is a constraint 
but vehicle restraint system is required. Now, let's see, the step-by-step -step process, of road construction. Scrap the ground surface, to meet the full depth construction depth. Then place, the geogrid, to improve the subgrade strength. Then place, the sub-base, and capping layers. Then place, the base course. Then place, the surface course, and road markings. Now, the road is ready, for vehicle loading. I hope, you have enjoyed this module. Please read, the disclaimer, for your information. Thank you.